Hey guys, and welcome back to Dangan Rumpa Trigger Heavy Havoc. As always, I'm Demon Fire 93, and last time we learned about the tragedy, the most tragic historic event of all human history. I don't remember what the acronym I made up for it was. It was the episode title. But you know, yeah, it's tragic, and it happened a year ago, and none of us know about it, but apparently it led to the headmaster and closing us all in the school, and now we're killing each other. So the headmaster is possibly the mastermind, and it's now morning time. I think I covered everything. <clears throat> Good morning, everyone! It is now 7 a.m., and nighttime is officially over! Time to rise and shine! Get ready to greet another beautiful day! All right. First things first, I need to head to the dining hall. Do I, though? Do I really? Wait, I didn't check my room when I... You know, I was doing all that running around and everything. I don't need to go in back. Ah, damn it all. Let me guess. I don't need to go in there right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fine, fine, fine. Be that way. Hey, hero. <laughs> Whoa, Makoto. Huh? Why do you sound so surprised? Sorry about that. It's just, uh... If you'd gone here even a minute earlier, it would have cost me a few more minutes of my life. What? Why? You know? Cause Kyoko, like, just left. Kyoko? For serious? You know, Makoto? When a guy and girl go at it, it shortens the lives of the people who have to watch it happen, too. How about that? And since it's me saying it, you know it's true. Hmm. So, like, hurry up and make it better. Yo! Anyway, see you at breakfast. That's easy for him to say, but what am I supposed to do? Tell Kyoko the truth? God! <clears throat> Good morning, Hina. Hey, Makoto. Morning. <laughs> hey, so yesterday, you were kind of cool. Uh-huh. What do you mean? Yeah. You know, when you said Alter Eagle was your friend? So, um... I was thinking the same thing. But when stuff like that happens, I never know how to say what I'm thinking. You got it! So I'm really glad you said it for me. So thanks. <laughs> You're welcome. Yeah! You're usually, like, totally normal, but when the time count comes, bam, you bust out your special power. Because, I mean... I mean, e even before yesterday, when stuff comes up, it's like, you always do something about it. Oh, Hina, getting a little hot for me there? Getting a little flushed. <clears throat> even before yesterday? Are you talking about the class trials and stuff? It's only because I'm the protagonist, and the game literally can't progress without me making the right fucking decision, apparently. I mean, that stuff is just... It's just kind of took care of itself, you know? Hmm. It totally didn't. Um... With your power and Sakura's and everyone else, I'm sure we'll get out of here. Yeah, I think you're right. Okay. I am right? All right. Now that we've got that fighting spirit, let's go get some grub. She's right. Even if the road is long, I need some food. If we don't keep on moving forward, we'll never reach our goal. Byakuya! What do you want? Uh, well, the, the breakfast meeting? That's enough. You honestly expect me to go? Right. Oh, as long as I'm here, I should ask Byakuya what he made of the stuff Alter Ego told us. Actually, no, I'd better not. The surveillance camera would catch us for sure. What? So? Oh, um, well, sorry, I was just inner monologuing to myself, and so when I do that, I have to go through the whole process of thinking that whole thought out loud, and then my, my YouTuber decides to narrate it and everything, and then, you know, you just kind of sit there staring at me like, what the fuck is with this guy? He's just kind of staring off into space, like, looking like he's talking to himself, and then, yeah, here we are. Goodbye. Loser. He's gone. He f turned around and faded into this corner. I don't know how he did it. Because he was facing this way. And he just turned around and left. Is there a hidden passage? No hidden passage? Alright, fine. I need to go to the dining hall. For the morning meeting. Oh, it's going to be the six of us today. Or just the five of us, because Kyoko decided to not be here. As I entered the dining hall, the first thing I saw was her. <laughs> what are you staring at? Oh, Toko. 
what's your problem? What? You think you, your eyes will rot just looking at me? <laughs> Fine, then. Just don't look at me. Uh, I think he's just surprised to see you at the breakfast meeting is all. <clears throat> Indeed, it's been quite a while since you joined us. Um... Yeah, what made you change your mind? Piaki said he <laughs> likes a girl to have some meat on her bones, so... I'm gonna start eating! I'm gonna force it down into my stomach! I'm gonna eat till I drop! Okay! I refuse to lose! You're just like me now! Hina, I wouldn't do that if I were you. Well, other than that, it looks like Kyoko isn't here. You know? Oh, she said she'd come by later. Later? You know? Yeah, after you leave. She's not even trying to hide it anymore. Mm -hmm. I know I said she wanted you to show some backbone, but you didn't need to show her that much. Just a second. You're dirty, Makoto. Dirty. President Dirty of Dirtlandia. But you were just saying how I was awesome before and cool, and I'm dirty. Why am I dirty? You don't understand. Just the worst. You're the type who takes the stairs of love three steps at a time, aren't you? I'm telling you, it's not like that. <laughs> just just shut heck? up already, Hina. You've been running your filthy mouth like that all morning. Whoa. Huh? Filthy? Me? <laughs> Don't make me repeat myself. Huh? I'm not filthy. <laughs> it's, it's no use denying it. We can all see how disgusting you are. Huh? Sh shut up. Uh? You and that lusty uh? body of yours. Night after night you go out for your illicit club meetings. Oh. Hey, knock it off. I can't deal with this dirty stuff like that. Your midnight <laughs> sex curricular activities only put us in even more danger. Please. S stop it. Uh. You'd like me to stop, uh. wouldn't you? What is going on? Your sweaty hands gripping the big, fat, chalk tight. I need an adult. <laughs> Going for all that extra credit. Your screams are like the screech of a violated blackboard. Good lord, Toko. Is this your, like, your, like, your writing coming through? Like, did you, like, get possessed by Hifumi and are getting his fanfic stuff mixed in with your regular writing? And, and, oh, it's amazing. Indecent ideas are coming to me one after another. They're definitely coming, all right. Bastard. So would you rather your black eye on the left or the right? Have your black eye on the right. So sorry, sorry, sorry. Hey, come on. Let's leave Toko alone. She's gone, gone a little funny from all her pent-up frustration. You know? Anyway, you and Kyoko need to make up already, you know? Yeah, I know. I mean, of course I want to make things... want things to get better as soon as possible. But with everything that's been going on, I haven't had a chance to talk to her about what I saw. Before anything, I need to talk to Sakura about it. So let's talk to Sakura about it. <clears throat> uh, Sakura? Mm -hmm. What is it? Can you make some time later? I was hoping I could talk to you. Ah! Uh, now that Makoto's dumped him, or that Kyoko's dumped him. Makoto's trying to win Sakura's heart? <laughs> are you in heat, Makoto? You don't care who they are as long as they've got the right equipment. Just <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, this game is too much. Watch out, Sakura. Makoto's transformed into a wild beast. Prime Minister Wild Beast of Beastopia. First I'm the, the king of dirt of Dirtlandia, and I'm the prime minister wild beast of Beastopia. Why is this happening to me? Can our talk wait till tomorrow? I'd like to get some rest today. Everything's just really fucking weird right now, Makono. For some reason, I've been feeling worn down these last few days. Are you sick? Did you get hurt? Mm. No, nothing serious. I've just had some minor aches and pains. 
Huh? Is that from the flashback fight? It must be because of that battle. Um. But it must be pretty bad if you had to have to go rest. Are you, are you sure you're okay? Mm. I'm sure a protein shake and some sleep will get me back on my feet. You got it. That's true. Protein is good for all kinds of stuff. Hey, you guys like worship protein. It's like your god or something. Okay. Makoto, I don't, I don't know what it is you want to talk, want to talk to Sakura about, but say it till tomorrow. She's in pain. Yeah, I, I got it. She told me herself. You don't need to reiterate it for her. I'm sorry. Sorry. You know. Well, for now, let's eat. Eat? I'm, I'm kind of nervous. Huh? Huh? How come? What's your problem? Come, I don't usually e eat in front of other people. <laughs> Ever since I was a kid, I, I eat by myself. What the heck? What about your family? Mm -hmm. Oh, well, yeah. I, I used to live with my t -t dad and mom and my mom. Huh? You had two, two moms? <laughs> What? That's just how things were. That's like a serious issue. Uh. Just let it go. You're asking for trouble getting involved with her more than you have to. <laughs> how dare you speak to me like that with that, with that disgusting mouth of yours. Don't go back to the goddamn dirty, filthy whore that she is. Oh my god. Oh. Stop saying stuff like that. Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and eat. If I don't, Kyoko will never show up. <sighs> Pretty miserable situation, man. <laughs> yeah. I scarfed down breakfast as fast as I could and immediately headed back to my room. Free time! Yeah? I'll have to wait till tomorrow to confront Sakura about what I saw. But in a way, I'm kind of relieved. It takes a lot of courage to stand face to face with Sakura and accuse her of something. Free time. So who do we think is gonna die next? Just, just a question. You know, cause I seem to be pretty lucky about picking the people who are gonna die as my next person that I can uh, go hang out with. So let's see where people are. Nope. Nobody's on this floor. Okay. Nobody's on the second floor. Nobody's on that floor. Nobody's on the third floor. Ah, those two are on the fourth floor there. So I can't even... I can't even go to, to like, try and talk with Sakura at all. Oh, there's Sakura. <laughs> well, have we tried to go to Sakura's room? Can we? Can we try that? I'm just curious to see if I can actually go to Sakura's room, even though it says that wait till tomorrow. I guess I should press the doorbell. It's you. I'm sorry. Is it okay if we talk more tomorrow? Right now, I need to rest. Damn. All right, fine. I thought for sure I could still do free time with her. But, let's go to the shop instead. Because we got 144 mana coins to spend. That's a lot of coins. And we're going to blow through them real quick, though. And I think there's some more coins in here, possibly. Yep. 147. Can I hit a 150? Nope. I can't. Alright, fine. Then to the Mono Mono Machine. Give it a shot. Why not? Okay. Ten coins at a time. It's a bong! I already had that. It's a book! Cat dog. I already had that one too. It's a lucky! Which is... A radio that I think I already had too.
That one looks new, I think. Yep, it is. <clears throat> that one is maybe new? Nope, it wasn't. Damn. Baseball! Oh, only... Leon wasn't dead. Twelve at a time! Jar of ramen? Thirteen at a time! A ring? Interesting. A gun! <clears throat> Fourteen at a time? That one looks new, too. Fifteen at a time! My god, we're just getting all the new stuff, aren't we? I mean, let's just max it out, you know? Damn it! I gotta repeat. Alright, whoops, wrong button. Not bad, not a bad haul. I got some stuff. You know what that means? I don't know what that means. I mean... Uh, uh, everybody's up on the fourth floor. How do I, there, there's my go button, okay. So we're gonna go up to the fourth floor, and we're gonna, 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 Kyoko, 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 where is Kyoko? Where was Kyoko? Kyoko? Is she in the girl's bathroom? Damn it. I bet if I go to Hero here. Wait. Kyoko? Uh huh. Kyoko! The game says you're in this hall, but I don't see you in this hall at all. Oh, hi. <laughs> anyway. I'm busy, I don't have time to waste. Well, fuck you two then, okay? I mean, do I become friends with Hero? Do I finally embrace the weirdness that is Hero? Or do we go give Hina another inner tube? I'm gonna give Hina another inner tube. Sorry, hero. Alright, she is in the music room. What the fuck was that? That was a weird noise. Hina, I've got a present for you. Hopefully you've got something for me too, like a new ability, a skill. Pushing them doesn't... Push, pushing on them... Pushing on them doesn't help. Smacking them doesn't help. What the heck is up with those things? What are we talking about? Because my mind immediately goes to a very dirty place. What are you talking about? Yeah! Oh, sorry, I'm talking about the metal plates covering all the wall windows. That makes much more sense. Okay. I thought that you were taking uh, Toko... Well, not extra Tokos. It was, Toko, but not Toko, but Genocide Jill's, you know, um, comments to heart, you know, how she kept saying that you've got huge tits, you know, <laughs> smacking them doesn't make them smaller. <laughs> <laughs> I know, we should try grabbing the top and yanking down on it. <laughs> God damn it. Oh my God, I should not be playing this this late at night. I'm just slap happy and stupid. Can I talk to Hina for a while? Yeah, let's spend some time with Hina. You got it! You wanna do some stretches with me? Sure! Why not? I followed Hina's lead and did some elaborate stretching. Yeah, we'll do the towel rub again, where you strip down and rub yourself to a towel. Half naked. We'll do that together. 
He and I grew a little closer today. Would you like to give Hina a present? Yes, definitely! <laughs> what would you like to give her? Oh, I could give her mineral water too. That would probably help her out. So, pris prismatic heart track? Hard tack. Flotation donuts. Give. Huh? What? I can keep this, right? Right? Yay! Ultra stoked! Seeing Hina so pleased with something I gave her makes me happy. Is something wrong, Hina? I've reached my limit. Just a second! I'm stuck in here. Can't do any sports. Can't do anything. I'm sick of it. I want to get out under the sun and do some laughs. Run a marathon. I want to do some real sports. I mean, Hina, you're the ultimate swimmer. Swimming is your sport. There's a fucking pool here. Hina, calm down, okay? What the heck? I can't do anything in here. If I can't move around, I'm gonna die like a bunny rabbit. But I always heard rabbits die from loneliness. That's terrible. Whatever, I'm gonna die if I can't get some proper physical activity. Don't you think that's a little extreme? What the heck? You think I'm kidding, don't you? But I'm s I am seriously can't sit still, you know? Why else would I have joined six sports teams in school? Six? That's right. Yeah, track, basketball, softball, volleyball, tennis, and the big one. The big one. She got to her main sport, but ran out of juice. I think it's gotta be going home to swim. Your main sport is swimming, right? What, is that? what the hell is bouldering? Mm. Yeah, you got it. Gah. I don't even care what stroke it is. Just get me in a pool under the blue sky. I feel like this dialogue tree was meant for me to become friends with Hina in like episode one before we unlocked the floor with the pool because we have a pool. Go swim last, girl. But isn't it hard to do that many sports even for you? Well... If I can't move, I'll just shrivel up and die. And I need a challenge. More and more new stuff to try. A challenge? Because, I mean... What I really love about sports isn't winning, you know? It's having to fight and struggle and give it all you got to reach the top. Well, I mean, we're definitely all having to fight and struggle right now for our lives, so that's a good sport for you. It's the ultimate sport for you all. Honestly, it's like the ultimate game. It's that excitement, that fear that you might suffer a heartbreaking loss. But... When you finally reach that goal, it's just lonely. It's lonely at the top, you know? I never really go, got into sports, so I couldn't really relate to what she was talking about. But I could tell that the reason Hina was so amazed what was amazing was how hard she could fight and struggle. Um... So that's why I want to push myself as hard as possible when it comes to swimming. I want to aim for the very highest mountaintop. The highest mountaintop? Okay. I'm talking about the gold medal, of course. Aim for the gold, even if it means I'm a super gold spaz. Did she just call herself? Okay, but if that's what you want, isn't that all the more reason? If you have a goal, why are you standing around making excuses? Huh? Excuses? Just a second. Hey, when did I ever make any excuses? Sure, maybe we're stuck in here right now with no way out. But if you really want to make an effort, shouldn't you try to see what you can do in here? Push-ups. Sit-ups. Keep yourself fit. Oh. <clears throat> That's a challenge. You just made an official challenge. Yeah, totally. But I think you're right. If I want to get that gold medal, I have to make every effort I can. I want to become a genius of effort. I bet Ian Thorpe said something like that. Okay. Yeah, I can't go around making excuses just because we're stuck in here. All right, I think I'm going to go do some push-ups in my room. Like, maybe like, around a thousand or something. Almost before she was done talking, Hina took off like a bat out of hell. She recovered exactly as fast and strong as I would have expected. Hina's report card has been updated based on your experience with her. Your maximum number of skill points has increased. Hey, look at you go. God fucking damn it. Once we were all done, I headed back to my room for a little while. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. I was hoping for another skill. I have plenty of time. I don't feel like just sitting around. I should go somewhere. More free time! Well, where's everybody at now? Let's check our map. Oh, 
Oh, everybody's up and down, on, down on the first floor now. Hina's in the the kitchen. Sakura's still not gonna let me hang out with her, I'm sure. Oh boy. Who do I hang out with? Okay. Do I talk to Hero? Hero, hero, hero. You know, I think I'm gonna go with... No. Sorry, hero. You're just weird, man. Hina! How's it going? Okay. Each and every person has to do their job. The cooperation of each player is true teamwork. You got it! That's a quote from the famous wrestling player, Yuji Matsuo. We gotta do the same thing. Cooperate so we can survive. Hmm, should I hang out with Hina for a while? Yes. Yeah. You wanna go for a run to release some of this stress? Hina and I went for a light run through the school. No running in the halls! <laughs> Hina and I grew a little closer today. Would you like to give Hina a present? Yes, although I don't know what I could give her. I got some mineral water. Two of them, even. I got three black croissants. I have no more flotation devices. Um, bunny earmuffs. And burst. But what the hell is the astral boy? Do ah, fucking! <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. Well, I guess she liked it anyways. I wanted to see what the astral thing doll was, but I clicked the right mouse button, which is the give, instead of the left mouse button, which is the info. Haha, <laughs> thoughtful. This is why I like you, Makoto. Uh. I, I mean, not like, 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 not like that, that kind of like. Seeing Kina so pleased with something I gave her makes me happy. Aww. Uh, hey, Makoto. I'm so tired. Yeah, you look pretty tired. What happened? Well... I woke up earlier than normal this morning, so I decided to do a push-up, sit-up, squat set. I ended up doing a thousand of each. Well, that would explain it. Aww. Tired, so tired. I want something sweet. I want those things you get when you mix flour, sugar, butter, and eggs, and deep fry them. So what Hina's looking for is a churro. Oh, I know, you want some donuts. Yes, um... she loves donuts. <laughs> Don't tell anyone, but there's actually a bunch of frozen donuts in the warehouse. Okay. Throw those in the microwave for a few seconds and, and just imagine. Imagine the warm chewiness of that donut. You know what I'm saying, right? You, you'd eat the crap out of that, right? You really do love donuts, huh? Just a second. Is there anyone who doesn't? Who on earth, no, who in the entire universe can say they hate donuts? Um. Think about the sensation of biting into a donut. First the sweetness floods your mouth, then the soft dough cushions you. Next you get that hint of egg and butter, right? Your whole body starts to melt. You feel like you're falling into the center of the donut itself. When people talk about the donut effect, effective, that's what they're talking about. That's absolutely not true. Oh, I can't take it anymore. I'm truly like Niagara Falls over here. Just a second. Get out of my way, Makoto, or I'm gonna uppercut, or I've got an uppercut with your name on it. Uh, I'm not in the way. <laughs> Wait for me, God of Donuts. Almost before she was done talking, Hina took off like a bat out of hell. Whenever I'm around her, I feel like I'm soaking in the essence of human vitality. I thought he was gonna say, I feel like I'm soaking in her saliva <laughs> from donuts. <laughs> he and his report card has been updated on your experience with her. God damn it, I still haven't gotten a skill from her! Ah, uh, I fucking hate it. After I watched her run off, I went back to my room. Well, that's all the time we got for today, guys. I know it's gonna be ding dong bing bong, right? Yep, there it is. Well, we'll see you guys next time.